Rock Alex, it's Diamond J. Terrence here. A uh, great new uh, recording artist from Warner Music Canada. His name is Philip Sace. Philip, thanks for stopping by. Oh man, thank you for having me. You signed in January. Yeah. New album coming out April the 7th. That's right. Uh, what's the title? It's called Influence. Um, I heard you have a pretty cool story about uh, how you even got the uh, recording deal and the album going. You know, it was actually really an amazing, amazing experience. Um, I received an email to my website, which I don't often check. And one day I just happened to check it and uh, there's an email from a guy named Steve, and he just said, Hey, man, I was on Spotify uh, listening to someone's playlist. I think it might have been a Slash playlist or something, uh, something or other. And he said, Hey, you know, I, I heard a song. I don't know your music, and I, I really dug it. And just wanted to reach out and say, Hey, man, what's up? I like your music. And uh, do you ever come to Toronto? So I said, Well, hey, man, I'm from Toronto. I emailed him back. I said, Yeah, I'm from Toronto originally. And um, so we just sort of struck up a, a bit of an email conversation. And it turned out that it was this fine gentleman named Steve Waxman who works at uh, Warner Music Canada. And um, he said, you know, he said, you know, you got any, anything new coming up? And I said, well, yeah, we've got a, a record that we're going to put out in Europe shortly. And this is toward the end of last year, uh, 2014. And wow. um, so I sent him the record, and then one thing led to another, and there was an opportunity to, to collaborate with Warner. You talked about, uh, before we were on the camera here, how you toured with Jeff Healy. Right. That, if you know guitar playing and rock blues in Canada, that, that would be, you can't get any higher than that, really. I don't think you can get any higher than that anywhere on the planet. How did that become to be when you toured with Jeff? When was that? Uh, that was about, well, I guess up until about the early 2000s I worked with Jeff. Mm -hmm. So uh, right out of high school, I uh, worked with him for four years. So out of high school? Yeah, pretty much. So, so most I, people looking for a regular part-time job, you know, pizza, he used to be playing with Jeff Healy with guitar. Well, he was an incredible mentor and a very generous man. and gave me a lot of room to grow and learn so I, I can't project on anyone else but for me it's important to make room in my life to do things that I love and I really love music and I think it's a it's sort of a contagious thing when you hang out with people that make room in their lives for things that they love to do it's it spreads and I think that's a good energy that we need to put more out there it doesn't need to be just glued to your your phone all the time looking at Instagram updates you know I think there's a lot more to life than that. There you go, ladies and gentlemen, uh, Philip Sayers, a Warner Music Canada recording artist. Uh, soon you'll see more of him very, very soon, I'm sure. That's a little steamroller. Thank you guys for having me today. All right. Get back to work. <laughs>